Absolutely. Well, she actually already has an otter here at the British Wildlife Centre. This is it. This is the squirrel enclosure. As you can see, there's no fences, nothing between you and the squirrels. It's fully interactive and you can walk through the feature. Now, Dame Judy Dench told me that she's only ever once seen a red squirrel in the wild. My husband and daughter and I were going up on the West Highland Line up to um, the west of Scotland and we suddenly stopped at Car Bridge and we looked, it was dawn, I think we'd gone all the way through and it was dawn. We just looked sideways where, where, where the train had stopped and there was this red squirrel sitting on a post. Now, you no longer see red squirrels in the wild in the south of England because grey squirrels have put pate to that. And can I just say, they not particularly good at performing on live television. So we spent the morning looking for the red squirrels. There are actually 20 in this enclosure, although I have to say I never saw two together. But uh, here's some pictures of them as we, we sort of spotted some running around a little bit earlier on today. And it's very exciting to see them. And one of the guests here today was uh, wildlife expert Chris Packham. And he explains to me why red squirrels are so significant. We're in an enclosure where you can walk through, and at the moment there are 17 squirrels in here. They're going to be up to 30 squirrels, so it's going to be squirrel-tastic. And they are enduringly charming with their little fluffy tails and their tufty ears. Um, they're the great British red squirrel, so people really, really like them. There you go, Bryony. It's going to be squirrel-tastic. Thank you very much, Caroline.